was no stopping the great Arnold Palmer in the Los Angeles Open. On the third round, he was well in the lead, beginning the new year in real style. His nearest opponent, Paul Harney, had only to sink his putt here for a tremendous last round of 67. At the last hole of all, Palmer was onto the green, still holding a winning lead. With the iron nerves of a champion, he took a 25-foot putt. It was in. So, Palmer had the first big tournament of 1966 in the bag and a check for $11,000. Across the Pacific to Sydney, where the game is tennis. And at the White City, Manuel Santana is the hero of the hour. The Spanish champion is at the very top of his form, and when it's all over, there was enthusiasm without parallel in the history of tennis. No holding the big Spanish contingent. They spontaneously broke into a traditional Catalonian dance. Maybe this will set the tone on the centre court at this year's Wimbledon. It is a poor groundsman. Indoors now for the San Francisco track meet. One of the high spots, the 60-yard hurdles. Earl McCulloch, a good winner. All eyes now on John Pennell, the first man to pole vault 17 feet. That was outdoors. This time, 16 feet, seven and a quarter. Pennell now tried for 16 feet, nine, hoping to set the world indoor record. No luck that time, but his fans are sure he'll make it before long.